Back so soon? What's the rush? Okay, okay, sit down, shut up, and pay attention. The misfit vault hunters had discovered the secret location of the Gortis project, but getting there wouldn't be easy. Hyperion had not forgotten about their renegade employees, and the native Pandoran wildlife was, uh, just getting to know them. They escaped with their lives, but not much else. Out in the wasteland, the former middle manager discovered Handsome Jack riding shotgun in his brain while having a shotgun pointed at his head. Fancy meeting you a precarious too. position, to be sure, but nothing compared to the con artist. The price on her head had attracted all kinds of thugs and gunmen. You'd think that would have been the end of her story. But hey, you never know when a polite reprogrammed killing machine will drop in and save the day. Was she bothering you? Back on the trail of the Gortis project, they found a wondrous hidden city, risen from the corpse of a ghost town. But unfortunately, their moment of awe and victory was to be the advantage of their opponents. <laughs> Checkmate. Taken hostage and forced to surrender the keys to the kingdom. They had to go all in on one last gamble. This chapter of the story begins with the questionable choice to trust the Pandoran Hustler. Must have been a tough decision. What, he's supposed to trust the psychopath? At least the psychopath had a plan. That's fair. Why did you choose Fiona? Especially when you consider your obsession with Jack. <laughs> he still doesn't think of it as an obsession. I uh, didn't trust Jack. You know, he's, he's unpredictable at best. <laughs> so it had less to do with trusting Fiona. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no. Jack being nuts is what made it an easy call. Thanks. <laughs> you know, and of course, come to find out that, that Jack is only slightly less nuts than she is! Look, someone had to take the initiative. It wasn't like there were a lot of options. I don't suppose there's a spare for the spare. Well, if there is, I'm not changing it this time. We're close. We can walk it from here. Where the hell is here? Yeah. And why is it where we are? I'll tell you when I find what we're looking for. So, what happened next? <laughs> well... Things started out fine. Oh, okay, so this was your plan. Just give me a light so I can see what I'm doing. Fine, here. Let's move. Well, where are we? Where are we even going? Because we are not helping them right now. No idea. Oh, good. We have to get back there. Vaughn and Sasha- I know. Sorry. 
Gary. What's going on? <coughs> Shut up! On. You find anything yet? Nah. Gary's dead. Who? Gary. Oh, right. Just find them and we can put an end to all this. Huh? Well, already ended for Gary. Stay here. Yeah, I'll stay here and look after the ball. Shh. <sighs> Hey, just come out, all right? Honestly, I, I will probably hurt you. So how quickly you come out will probably have to do with how much I hurt you. So if you come out quick, then dandy. Yeah, I did that once. You want to get in there real good tight. <clears throat> yeah, heard that didn't go so great. What? You should... Um... Was, hey, over there or something. I'm sticking my head up again after that? No, I'll tell you when to go, okay? I got it. You, I, I go when you say so. Now! Lobby from back here. No, we need Gordas first. You didn't get it? Focus, Reese. We need Gordas back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. Who knows how long Vasquez will keep Sasha and Vaughn around. We need to get Gordas and get upstairs. Look, I know you love that stupid thing, but it makes your head look big, and you should just get rid of it already, okay? Also, we're kind of in a hurry. Are you okay? Yeah. We can get up to the lobby from back here. No, we need Gordas first. You didn't get it? Focus, Reese. We need Gordas back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. Who knows how long Vasquez will keep Sasha and Vaughn around. Not bad, Reese. Well, I have my moments. One, so far. I had more. You just weren't around. Ah! Oh, shit. Are you okay? Yeah. We can get up to the lobby from back here. No, we need Gordas first. You didn't get it? 
Focus, Reese. We need Gordis back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. You throw something. <laughs> oh, clearly, you've never seen me throw something. Bad? <laughs> it is not great, no. Are you okay? Yeah. We can get up to the lobby from back here. No, we need Gordis first. You didn't get it? Focus, Reese. We need Gordis back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. Who knows how long Vasquez will keep Sasha and Vaughn around. But I like my hat. Now you can buy a new one. They'll be rich. Fair point. Touch goal! Or sh shit, I don't know. I'm happy! <laughs> Touch go- touch go? Shut up! Take this. I'll give you a boost. <laughs> you are so heavy! <laughs> it's the arm. And the ice cream. I hate you so much! If you'd help me... What could have been becomes what is! Come on, buddy, talk to me! Ooh. Crap. Loaderbot, would you mind? He can't move! He can't move! Okay. made it. Holy crap, what happened to him? You still breathing? That's, that's pretty important. Uh, look around anxiously twice if you're still breathing. Uh, we'll figure it out when we get out of here. Okay, well, ah! hopefully we can still get him out of here. Ah! Hey, I'm open to suggestions here, guys. Do you have an extra gun? Sasha, the ankles! All I can do is... Come 
on, hurry up! Please wait. Thanks. Don't mention it. <sighs> you the leader of this outfit? Hey, you all right there, buddy? I don't know any of these people. There she is. You remember me? Great. These jackasses. Oh, oh, she remembers, all right. No. Oh, that is ice cold. Good on you, girl. Some nice all last right, words. that's enough. Calm down, Finch. She's the one who shot the shit out of me. Oh, yes, she did. Please, just, just let me shoot that girl in the face. Get back in the truck. Just You're being a nuisance. Me too. But, Just to get man, this out of the even... way. Those guys might man, be afraid of you, why are you always getting but me I'm in not. Trouble? Well, that makes perfect sense. I haven't given you a reason to be afraid of me yet. Fee? Mmm. I see why you're Felix's favorite. Don't be surprised. I've known about you two for as long as you've been lifting watches. But I'm out ten million bucks, cause someone turned a simple deal into a complete shit show. Someone has to pay for that. <sighs> <sighs> Looks like we have a couple new contestants. This isn't good. Okay, okay, I know how it looks. Things got a little messed up, but- Shut up! I'll deal with you later. I just want to say I had nothing to do with this. Uh-huh. Who's to blame here, Fiona? I want a name. Calm down, Hugo. No, no. I just... Look, I just need her to know. She's gonna say it, it was my fault, and it's Give not... Give me a name. And Vasquez. He's the one to blame here. Did she say me? Really? And none of this would have happened if he hadn't screwed up the deal. Oh, she's lying. She is lying, Valerie. Please, you have got to believe me. It's not my fault! Look, I know you're super pissed, but we've got the Gordy's thing, and it is gonna get us a vault that is worth way more than ten million bucks, just like we told you. Everything is fine! We're fine! So this is what all the fuss is about. Yeah. Yeah. That's our little moneymaker. Huh? Then I guess I don't need you anymore. What? No! Oh, no! No! I suppose I don't need any of you. You just got cut out of the deal. With a knife? Yeah. That's not how it works. And that's not how it went. She put that gun in your vase and you went all... 
Keep talking. The truth this time. Fine. But where was I? <laughs> you were in the middle of this. I was getting Gordas back. Not here. We gotta go. This isn't over. You're the one leaving. Looks over to me. No. It'll feel much different than this. i let you know when it happens. Tell me, are you all... Just completely stupid? You're not getting gorgeous. What? What? I am here to help you. You idiots! Oh. This is easily the most annoying contract I've ever taken. Oh, at least if it was an assassination, I'd have the pleasure of a kill at the end of it. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Who even hired you? A man named Felix. I normally don't divulge that kind of information, but... So what do you know about Gordas? What are you even saying? I don't know what that word means. gore -tis. Are you sure you're pronouncing it correctly? No. Oh, wait. Years ago, when I was retiring those Atlas employees, it was a project many of them were working on. But I... never looked into it. Well, that's not helpful. So, you're... what, our bodyguard or something? Thankfully, no. More... God, I don't know, a mentor? Felix wanted me to pass along some knowledge. To help you survive, he felt you two had some untapped potential. Oh, well, Fiona, he was just thinking about our untapped potential. So, Athena, was that before or after he decided to rip us off and abandon us in the desert with a price out on our head? Thanks for stepping in with Valerie. Sure. Don't mention it. Ugh. Look, I know you two have been through a lot, but I assure you I'm here to help. And I don't anticipate that'll be very long, because when I feel the contract is filled, I'll be out of your lives. So let's just... get through this. Well, welcome aboard, I guess. Thank you. So, uh... What's up with your friend? <laughs> he got hit with some sort of... paralyzing shot. I mean, he's stiff as a board, but he's... he's fine, otherwise. Yeah, that was probably a poor choice. Oh yeah, I think I got something! What you got? I don't know, but I, I found out there's an on button somewhere. You've been looking at that thing for like 20 minutes. Well, it's apparently very small. Initiating Gorta's startup sequence. Energy chassis required for Vault of the Traveler protocol. Loading coordinates for energy chassis. Gortis activated. Happy birthday. Hi! Wow! Hey! Really great to meet you all. I think I was expecting something... different? Hi, Gordis. Welcome to the group. Thank you! I'm so happy to be here! This is all really exciting! Awesome! Awesome! Awesome. Awesome. 
Your friend is crying. Is he crying because he's sad or because he's happy? <sighs> I think he's crying because he can't blink. Oh! We should probably get him some you know, eye drops or something. Oh, cool! You've got another robot! It's very nice to meet you. How is your day going? Gordis, hi. Hi! So, from what I understand, you can get us a vault. Absolutely. Now, I don't know every detail, but I was created by Atlas as a last-ditch effort to get to the riches of a vault, to get a leg up on those Hyperion guys. Well, we are still number one. Atlas had facilities all over Pandora, working on the pieces of me to get it done faster. But then, that lady made it a little more difficult to assemble by killing every Atlas employee. Well, uh, how many more pieces are there? No idea, but the next piece we need is... Uh... Oh, that away! This should be interesting. Everybody up and at em. Come on, Slowpoke! Time's all wasted! Uh, Gordis? Hmm? He is, um... Oh, he's... he's dead, Gordis. Oh... No, no, he, he was a he was a bad person, like like really, really bad. Oh well, good riddance then. Hey, is there a video in this thing?
Hey, kid. Uh, just checking in. Don't want to distract you from the victory lap you're probably taking now that Vasquez is dead. But, uh, you haven't told Athena about me at all, have you? I didn't intend to. Okay, great, good. So just keep that frame of mind, because if you do tell her, she'll just cut your head off before you can even explain yourself. Not exaggerating. She really, really doesn't like me. Okay, look, kiddo. Stop calling me kiddo, please. Who are you talking to? Uh, I... <laughs> Oh, you know, just, just myself, just psyching myself up to find this fault, you know what I mean? All right. <clears throat> I suddenly need to go to the roof. Listen, you're probably gonna die, you know that, right? But I'm not talking about Athena here. I'm, I'm just saying, like, in general. General sort of impending death. Oh, okay. Is this about me not letting you take over my cybernetics? Yeah, it's about that. You trusted that floozy with a flashbang over your old pal Jack here, and look where I got you. I could have grabbed that drone before he turned your buddy into a coat rack. I am uh, detecting a little lack of trust here, pal. What's going on? Tick tock. Why'd you go with What's Her Nuts' plan instead of mine, huh? Your brain fall out of your head? Don't feel like explaining yourself, huh? All right, I get it. Props. Pretty alpha. Look, you don't trust me, I get it. But let me spoil the big secret about surviving on Pandora for you. It's not about who's got the biggest gun, it's about teamwork. And more than that, it's about compromise. If your old pal Vasquez had just given you your promotion, he wouldn't be dead, would he? Says the dead guy. Yeah, all right, sure. Yeah, you know what? Let's talk about that. You know why I died? Why is that guy talking to himself? Well, because Vault... Because I didn't work with the people I didn't trust. If I'd have just thrown stock options at the Vault Hunters instead of bullets, I'd be on a beach right now, doing disturbingly graphic things with the local ladies. And if you can't learn to work with the people you want to punch in the throat, well, you're, you're gonna die. Nothing but your pride and a big, fat hole in your sternum. It sucks. Shit hurts. Well, if I'm gonna die anyway, I'd rather die a good guy. Oh, is that so? Because if you want, I can overload the neurons to your brain right now. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's just, I'm just kidding. I'm messing with you. I totally can't do that. You know what? Or can I? Nah, I can't. No, I'm just being a dick. You want to live. No, that's good. That's good. What the hell is that? I'm detecting some tension here, which is a bummer. We should be pals, you know? I actually see a lot of myself in you. And I know I've done some kind of things, but we're a team here, kiddo. And you can even ask Athena. I always look out for my team, so I'm just asking you. Trust me here. We've got so much in common. I guess we can work together. For now. You see? That wasn't so hard. I won't let you down, kid. I'm gonna race. You just made a powerful power. That sounded bad. Yeah, yeah, I just realized that sounded kind of ominous. <laughs> like I was gonna kill you or something. I, I didn't actually mean it that way. My bad. Hey, we're pals. Everyone's back. That reminds me, though. Since we're gonna be stuck with each other for the foreseeable future, I kind of want to know where the hell we're going. You know where we're going. We're following... No, 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 no. Not, not, not like in general, idiot. What is it you want out of all this? Because I am going to help you get it. I need you watching my back. And I will. You just got to let me. You know, there's only so much I can do as a disembodied boogeyman. You know what I'm saying? Next time I can do something to help, just think it over. But yeah, that's all I need to know. Maybe we'll talk later. This, this is this has been good. It's a good chat.
Now you two got pretty chummy. Are all your BFFs murderous monsters? Guys, can we just call it for the night? We're not gonna find anything in this light. Yeah. All right. Your mask. What about it? It hides your identity. That is the definition of a mask, yes. What of it? I can't think of any reason you'd need both of us. I don't. But for whatever reason, it seems that Gordas does. That's where my interest lies. Well, I guess what I meant was... I'm interested that you're interested. I see what you're trying to do, and I won't fall for it. No, none of the lines I put you on make any sense without you either knowing us or needing us. It's compelling theory. How confident are you in this hunch? What I mean is, do you care to make a wager? I don't make bets when I don't know the outcome. Just thinking out loud. You should do a little less of that. Tell me about the dome. I'm done talking for a while. He can fill you in. Hey! What? Who wants to know about the dome? Well, the creepy part or the pretty part? All of it. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen that many plants in one place before. Try not to let all the nature scare you too much, Hyperion. Desert, ice, and now this. I have never seen anything like it before. And this is where the upgrade thingy is? So close! This is definitely a little weird. What the hell is this place? These aren't frozen. Huh, cool. I've been on Pandora all my life. I've never even heard of this place. Oh, pff, this place is nothing. You should see how Pandora looks from Helios. Is it pretty from up there? It does. You know, so does every planet. I mean, even a nasty death trap like this one. <laughs> huh. I see. <laughs> I'll just be on my way. How do we get in? I 
thought you destroyed everything, Atlas. Huh. Guess I missed this one. What would you have done if you'd found it? Reduce it to rubble, grind the rubble to dust, kill everyone inside. The standard. Huh. I'm puzzled by the plants, though. Never seen any Atlas facility like this. Yeah? Thinking maybe you won't pull your usual reduce it to rubble, etc., etc.? Eh. exciting thing I've ever done. How are my two favorite robots? You guys having a good time together? Huh? Exchanging oil recipes or whatever you talk about? Yes! I'm learning so much about how you dropped a fake ball key, how you lost ten million dollars, and how- Gee! Thanks! I cannot hold back your tide of bad decisions. Just want to make sure both of you are good. Been a crazy day, am I right? Huh? You are very right. Wait, you're not being sarcastic, are you? Why would I? Wow, I am so not used to this. It's kind of refreshing. Hey, robots, uh, what you doing? Have you found my upgrade yet? No. Oh, I see. Hey, I'll keep looking. We'll, we'll find it. LB, your joints holding up okay in this cold? This unit's aftermarket parts are holding up adequately. <laughs> right. Hey, you guys let me know if you find it. Thing, all right, I'm gonna keep poking around. Hello, how do we get you open? How am I? too long to be a tie, and then I saw it tucked into his pants, and then I had no idea what was going on. You know what it is? It is a tie. I have concluded that most humans lack standard fashion circuitry. That's awful. Maybe someone should tell him. Yo, loader bot. Could you use a hand here, old amigo? My human needs me. Hey, hey, you, you okay? Greeting. Denied. So it seems like you guys have history. Come on, I'm sorry, okay? Look, you were being torn apart. Someone was beating you with your own arm. You know how freaky that was to watch? I guess I thought blowing you up would put you out of your misery. You would like this unit to execute forgiveness protocol like you forgave Vaughn? Yes, please forgive me.
Ha <laughs> ha, we made it. Entrance this way. Let's see what else this place has to offer. Anyone else's creepometer going bananas right now? <laughs> Loaderbot, what did he say? Unclear. I am unable to translate paralytic grunts. So, my upgrade's nearby. Sorry, it's kind of spooky in here. You know, just once, I'd like to search an abandoned health spa or something. Fluffy towels. Gordis, when you said nearby, do you mean like in this room nearby? I mean, it's definitely close, but there's not like a holy beacon on it or anything. Let's look around. I think the technical term for this is highly goddamn suspicious. What's that? Map. Oh, what, what kind of map? Unclear. The markings on it seem deliberately obscure. Oh, how fun! Like a treasure hunt map! Uh, yeah, Gordis, something like that. But it doesn't appear to lead to anything, so I doubt it has anything to do with your upgrades. Are you sure your upgrade is around here? I'm positive my energy chassis is here. Somewhere in the general vicinity. Ish. We will find it. It will be glorious. Aw, thank you. I'll just keep looking. Any luck? No, but... Reese found out where we are. Or at least what this place was. Some kind of top secret Atlas biodome. Not much else in the system. Any sign of the Gordas upgrade? Not yet. We'll keep looking. What do you got? Clothes. Looks like someone was wearing this recently. Find anything? Well, kinda. I mean, this place is Atlas, but it was some kind of terraforming facility. They were growing plants. I thought all you corporations were just about mass market destruction. I am not a corporation. And see, you learned something today. What about Gordas's upgrade? Is it here? Well, nothing in the files yet, but a lot of it's been deleted, so that probably says something. You find something? Uh-huh. Dust. I found dust. Atlas Extreme Latte 5000. Is it still working? Huh? Why? Atlas might be full of corrupt, murderous bastards, but they made the best lattes. Nope. Ugh. Damn Atlas. <laughs> oh, bastard?
Nothing here. Fresh fruit. And here? Find something? Yeah, Drake fruit stash. Like actual Drake fruit? Can I have some of it? Someone took a bite out of the only fresh piece. So sure, if you want cooties. This is weird. I think someone's been living here. Don't worry so much. Maybe he'll be nice. Or she. Could always be a she. Oops. Portis? Portis! Don't kill me! Please, please don't kill me. I, I, I have just been watching you. Just, just watching, that's all. I swear, I am completely harmless. There is absolutely no need for you to kill me. I, I assure you. Everything's okay. If you're not here to hurt us, we're not here to hurt you. Thank you for that. It is genuinely rare to encounter reasonable, somewhat intelligent-seeming people. Hey there! That little robot's why we're here. There's an upgrade somewhere nearby. We're looking for it. Well, I, I, I can't help you with that. I know nothing about it. So, you should leave. We all should leave, all of us, going our separate ways. I can leave right now, in fact, and if anyone asks, not that anyone would, of course, but I, I'll tell them, I'll say, I didn't see you. Oh, for... Hey, remember this? The part where you were begging us not to kill you? Let's rewind, shall we? I... I just... I... I, um... Oh, uh, your, your friend there. Does he happen to suffer from artificially induced hemispherical abdomission? Paralysis. Yeah, that's a good question, Vaughn. Why didn't you just say paralysis? Because he's not technically paralyzed. Uh, the contortion, the blinkless eyes, all signs of a toxin called thanatopsol. Wait, 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 you've seen this before? Yes, if you let me get a better look at him. Well, then you can fix him. Of course you can, right? You're a doctor. We have no idea if he's a doctor. Let's just assume that he is. Help me get your friend on the table. There, good. Bully, here we are. Actually, young lady, I could use... Uh, yeah. Okay. What am I doing with this? You're plunging it into his heart. So, what now? I don't know. I've never done anything like this before. Uh, what? I thought you knew... <laughs> Someone please spit in my eye! Or lick! Lick my eye! I don't care! Lick oh me god, in the, eye. the toxin turned him insane. Or into an eyeball fetishist. He's dehydrated. But the shot you gave him should help. Oh, oh, oh man. Oh, that's the stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for blinking. Oh, god. Well, oh. glad I could help. Well, hang on there, duck. If that is your real name. It's not, and I never said it was. Well, I'm not done with you yet. There's no need for you to be this suspicious, surely. But I just helped him. <sighs> Very well. I'm on the run, you see. I have lost everything. My wife. My son. My cat. I did not lose them in that order, though. I, I lost my wife first, then my cat, then my son. So, wife, cat, son. 
You ever thought of becoming a professional storyteller? Because I gotta tell you, your sense for crucial information is just... Reese. Forgive me. It's been a long time since I've enjoyed human contact. Uh, perhaps I've forgotten how to talk to people. You must understand, I've suffered months of wandering, isolation, skulking from one location to the next, broken, ashamed, homeless. I got here to this place only minutes ago, so... I'd ask that you leave me now to my demons and go. That's a sad story, but I still don't trust him. I saw your map. Which I assume you made while exploring this facility? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, no? So maybe you won't mind if I... No! Don't do that! To that uh, is map, is it? Uh, that I've never seen before. Just fond of paper. You know, you seem like an intelligent man. You've probably figured out by now that the easiest way to end all this and get rid of us is simply tell the truth. Proposal accepted, young lady. I'll tell you what you want to know. Follow me. I am not a simple traveler. I've lived here for months. So, dead wife, dead kid, that's all horse crap? Yes. Although Skaggs did eat my cat. Oh, Guy's the cat. He was a terrible cat. By which you mean he was a cat, am I right? <laughs> Jeez, tough room. The bunker within that jungle. I suspect it contains the upgrade you're looking for. I wish I could tell you more about what's inside, but I was never brave enough to check. The problem, your problem, is the Atlas automated security system that surrounds said bunker. Isn't it always? If I were you, and in this instance I'm relieved I am not, I'd gain access to the security tower, which is... there. <laughs> I can get in and disable the security systems. Easy. Not easy. Not at all easy, but your best option nonetheless. Automated security system, huh? Huh. Just realized the acronym for that is ASS! What kind of defenses are we talking about here? Oh, the usual medley of turrets and laser grids. Self-regulated, self-controlling, all lethal, of course. Reese, that sounds like something you can handle, right? Please, in my sleep. So we're done talking, then? We can actually go secure this upgrade now? Fiona, while Mr. Robot Eye here hits the security tower and hacks the defenses, you and I will infiltrate the bunker and grab the upgrade. Let's get this gorgeous piece and get out of here, huh? Oh, uh, you and I? Yeah, let's work together on this one. Okay, little update from me, uh, which is... I feel terrible! Not good at all, and I'm sure I've got some residual nerve damage. Oh, almost certainly you do. Right, thank you for that input. So, I'm gonna maybe chill out here? That's cool with everyone? Uh, yeah, that's okay. I'll go with Reese. There's a lot of stuff I can do, right? Huh? I mean, I don't have a robot eye. I'm not a highly trained assassin. Also not particularly charming, but, but I can still do stuff. Hey, I got a job for you. Use the computers in here and find out whatever you can about Atlas, Gordas, or the vaults. You've come to the right man. All right. Everyone knows what they're doing? Yeah. Uh -huh. And with a plan like this, what could possibly go wrong? So despite my incredible leadership efforts going unnoticed, Sasha and I went to go brave the catwalks and find the security station. <laughs> How are you not permanently damaged from all this brain trauma? I'm perfectly fine, thank you. I've got a tough noggin. Just ask Vasquez. Or... never mind. Huh. Huh. 
<laughs> Perfectly fine, huh? Not as useless as I first thought. I mean, when I first saw you guys, I thought, wow, no wonder Hyperion isn't what it used to be. <laughs> you know, when I first saw you at the deal with the uh, nose ring boy, I thought, uh, these two don't know what the hell they're doing. You weren't wrong about that. August was a mark. Nothing more, nothing less. Ooh. Nothing less? I don't know why I said that part. Felt like I was supposed to. You spend a certain amount of time with someone. You, you get to see a side of them you might not have been expecting. Oh, huh. right. So what you're saying is he was really into guns. Exactly. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so... I've never seen anything like it. Oh, okay, we are pretty high. You have a problem with heights? Sometimes. It's most, mostly when I look down. <laughs> well then, don't look down. Don't be scared. I won't let you fall. Okay, come on. Wow, you made that look really easy. Well, that's because it is. <laughs> Right. Okay, go time. Oh, okay, yeah, that was totally not scary. If you thought that was scary, you should try looking. Oh! <laughs> Hope you brought some bug spray. <laughs> Sasha! I'm all right! Don't look down. Okay! And don't puke on me! <laughs> no promises. <laughs> all right, all right. Just stay calm. You've got to climb up. Robot arm. Stronger than regular arm! You're doing great. I'm going as fast as I can! Oh, it's gonna go! Hold tight! Just hold on, okay? It's gonna take a little longer. I'm losing strength! Reese, I'm letting go. There's no way you're getting up that with me hanging on you. No! There's no need to sacrifice yourself, Sasha! You have to trust me! I'll get us out of this! It's okay, Sasha. Sasha! No! 
Wow, we are really close to the ground, aren't we? You sure know how to make things dramatic. I mean, t to be fair, you, you, you did tell me not to look down. Well, you can drop down now. Yep, okay. <clears throat> okay, you is, can you, get down yeah, now. Down. And for the record, I didn't let you fall. Ooh, we made it. <laughs> See, I, I thought you were sacrificing yourself so I could survive. <laughs> no, I, uh, I wouldn't do that. Nor would I expect you to. Hence the whole screaming, wetting myself bit. I didn't actually wet myself, I'm just more of a hyperbole. So, right. The turret controls we need to get to are back up there. Guess we'll take the scenic route. <laughs> it's just trees. Totally, that was a sarcastic wow. This beautiful jungle has no effect on me. I agree. Just two cool chicks who don't find pleasure in things. <laughs> That's us. Come on, the Gordis upgrade is that way. Wow, that's, uh, that's a big fruit. I don't even think Vaughn could finish that off. From what I've seen, he'd eat that and all the rest of it before we could pull out our rifles. <laughs> Look at that. Nature's taking it all back. As it should. Thing. That is an opportunity. What are you packing? That little sleeve pistol? You're going to need more than that. Yep. Sucks. Who walks around Pandora with a gun that can only carry one bullet? Felix put training wheels on this thing. He was holding you back. What, was he scared I'd hurt myself? There. No more elemental burnout. And if you're worried about bullets... So now I... Now you take it down! Doesn't work, Fiona. It's going to kill you. You should do something. You're supposed to be protecting me, right? Are you gonna like kill it or something? That plant didn't kill you. And once you're a proper vault hunter, little annoyances like that will continue to not kill you, over and over again. You keep calling me vault hunter, but I'm not like you. I can't throw a shield or go invisible. My one talent involves talking at people until they get confused. We don't all get to choose our talents, Fiona. Look at me. Do you think I would have chosen a shield to protect myself out here? I learned to make do. You've spent your entire life outthinking your enemies. Do that now. See the outcomes before you act.
Wasn't so hard, was it? You think so? Hmm. Fiona the Vault Hunter. I kinda like it. Come on. The sooner we can upgrade Gordis, the sooner we can leave. After a while, you just sort of feel like you've seen everything. Like you can't be surprised by anything anymore. <sighs> okay, so I'm, I'm going to stick this on your head. And, and, and please don't stab me. Okay... And there you go. Oh, thanks. How do I look? <gasps> mm. <laughs> 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 what the hell is that? This is why we can't have anything nice. Red means bad, right? Ow! Ah! Oh. <sighs> Over there! Finally! Something slow! <sighs> uh, Brees, there's no power. Uh, hang on, I think I can just start it. This is why we can't have anything nice. Red means bad, right? Oh, good. This is slow, too. Huh. This is weird. There. You can handle this on your own. Oh crap. 
Hi, Janie. Athena, where are you? Go on. I told you, darling, I'm just out on a long delivery. It won't be much longer at all. Athena? I'm serious. I'm just delivering the package now to the customer. Uh-huh. Yeah, I know that. Ahem. <clears throat> Gotta run. Another delivery. I... I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <sighs> Oh, that sounded... uncomfortable. That was my girlfriend, Springs. She... doesn't know I still do the vault hunting and adventuring and everything. It's not that I want to lie to her. Well, I think it's smart that you keep this from her. I mean, she would just worry. I'm not always so sure. She wants us to keep a low profile and for me to leave all that vault hunting and assassin work behind. Let's just keep moving. Looks like this piece of tin could probably be popped right off if we yanked hard enough. Ideas? Oh, hang on. I got this. Is that an eye? Uh-huh. Why are you carrying an eye around in your pocket? I thought it might come in handy. Welcome, General Pollux. See? It came in handy. That is so weird. Your carrying that around is the weirdest thing I have ever seen, and I have seen a lot. It is not that Oh weird. my god! Yes. Yes, it is. That's beautiful. Yeah, good drop. Let's grab it and go. See? Oh, wow. Okay. Whatever you gotta do, you should probably do it faster than you were planning. Yeah. This should be easy. Just need to match up the circuits for the security systems. And that will shut it down? Yeah, that's the plan. Well, you know, it's kind of like pulling strings. You <laughs> Grace, what are you doing? I'll do better. What exactly are you doing? Well, I'm trying to patch into security. There we go! Oh, crap. Sasha, look at this. He's an Atlas scientist? Oh, this is not good. Come on! Of course. Behind that shield, right? Until it runs out of energy and we're both shot to death. Yes! Look 
If I time it right, I can run through the gunfire. Nuh uh! Not on my watch! I like your confidence, but. Grab the Gordon's upgrade. Quick! I guess this is the energy chassis. Any idea what it does? It gets us one step closer to a vault. Is it worth it? Constantly risking your life trying to find out what's inside of a vault? Hell yeah it is. And I miss it. I know I made a promise to Janie, but... The thrill. There's nothing like it. Come on. Let's get this thing back so it can do... whatever it does. This is what you've been looking for? Yes. Oh, man. Okay, what are the odds that you'd find that piece just as Fiona told that part of the story? Just lucky, I guess. Sure. Lucky. Uh-huh. What do you want with that thing, huh? Clearly you know what happened. If I knew everything, you wouldn't be here. I'm saying I would have killed you. Uh, yeah, we get it. Oh, you made it! <laughs> awesome! Hey, so that thing you wanted me to look into? The vault? Yeah. The specific one we're going after is called the Vault of the Traveler. Okay, why is it called that? Well, it, it apparently teleports all over the universe. Well, that's fantastic. I know! You've returned, and with the Gordis upgrade, no less. Huzzah! I take it that you'll be on your way then. No point dawdling in a crubby, rundown facility like this. Time must be of the essence, isn't it? And you need to be off to the next part of your adventure. We came here to upgrade Gordis. No one's leaving till we do that. And no one is doing that until Reese gets back. Well, perhaps I should be the one to leave then. What happened? Um, oh, Reese just took a spill. He's, he's totally fine. His sick spill. Fine. Oh. Good. We learned something. About Cassius. Why are you looking at me? He works for Atlas. You lying Atlas shit! Whoa, whoa! What are you doing? You're filling an obligation. Why is everyone so excited? What's happening? I knew this day would eventually come. You sure took your time. Well, your wait will soon be over. So you know all about Gordas. I know that it was an initiative that this facility was a part of, but it wasn't my department. Although, I suppose I've inherited it at this point. As far as I'm aware, I am the last remaining Atlas employee on Pandora. And you're the last to die. Wait! Why are you doing this? Because... Because Atlas tricked me into killing my own sister. Okay? What would you do if that happened to you? I'd burn everything to the ground. The what would I do? I'd get my revenge. She's right. How can you say that? Please. It's okay. I see now. And I accept my fate. I... I don't understand. Athena, I wish you peace. This... this isn't right. Quiet. It just... it doesn't have to be... Quiet! Holy <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap, what was that? Athena! Oh no! Oh, Fiona! 
Of course. Buddy, how's the head? Uh, where am I? Now we're in a whole world of hurt, buddy boy. That's, a, that's what you get for trusting your friends. You never have friends. You never get screwed by friends. That's uh, that's my motto. Hey, kid, remember me? Grab him. Where's Gordas? Now you all have a habit of making me ask twice. I don't know what I'm supposed to be more scared of. The oversized piece of crap that belches fire, or the rocket launcher she's holding. <laughs> Good one. Is that my Gordas stuck in that loader bot? August! I got it! Are you sassing me, son? You said get it, and I said I got it. How's that sassing? It was your tone. One. My tone is of a person sick of chasing these assholes. But like I said, I got it. This is an outrage. Let me speak to your manager. Well, this looks bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and hang out in the back of your brain in case it somehow doesn't get the crap killed out of it. Peace. Oh, your friends can't hear you, girl. Oh, no, wait. Where's oh. the... <laughs> you looking for this? Guess you must have misplaced it. Now, I don't know what this thing is, but you obviously want it. And that kind of makes me obviously want it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> You don't like that. <laughs> Whoopsies, sucker. <laughs> what? You think we stupid or something? Ain't nobody pulling that crap on me again. So, when you took it from me, you must have realized that Derringer is a remote-activated grenade, right? Got a transmitter implanted in my tooth. What? Whoa! Ha! <laughs> What the? Man, what is that? You see something? Will you give me a second, dude? Damn. Hurry up, man. Oh, man, just blast the bush and be done with it. I don't want to get ambushed. I'm the one that'll get ambushed, man. What's your problem? What the? by the way. Yeah, well, I've been practicing. Now get me out of here. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, shit. shit. <sighs> Sorry, Fee. Ah! Uh, 
Toma! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Think you're so damn tough. So nauseous right now. Face me! Athena? Sounds like she's in trouble. Greetings. Have you seen Cortez? They went that way. My thanks is eternal. Wait, Loderbot, hold up! Where are you going? Well, we need to get Gordas back. You help out Athena, I'll go drag Reese's ass out of the fire. Again. You gonna be okay? Just be careful, Sash. Nah. Have fun out there. You too. Pretty impressive. I know. Come on, let's get Gordis back. Keep it safe. Here, Gordis will need it. Keep the Gordis piece from Finch and Kroger. Got it. Atta boy. Wait, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna stop the truck. How? I don't know, just cover me. With what? You'll figure it out. Hey. Ah, it's a bad thing. Loader back. We gotta get rid of that gun. Kill me in close. Anything for you. Never mind. Other way. Other way. Yes, we did! No, not officially! Well, then I have 
officially... Which is why I'm officially breaking up with you now! Oh my god, you are out of your... I'm going after Gordas! Then do it! Gordas! I don't know you, but you really ought to run. This is Vault Hunter business. Ain't no reason for you to get caught in a crossfire. <laughs> Unless you're holding a lot of sweet loot anyway. I am a Vault Hunter. <laughs> All right, whatever you say. <laughs> This is gonna be fun. What the hell? I scammed! Hey! So people are still trying to kill us. What do we do? Help us! Take a new leg thingies! Just get us out of this somehow! Don't know. Maybe. Looks like the cavalry's here, ass whites. Time to go! Oh no you don't! Later, jackass! Enjoy the flight! Do it! 
This is gonna be bad. Here comes the pain train! Woo -woo! Pinky toe! Come here! I never thought of you as the caring type, Athena. is imprinted to us. It'll never work with you. Why do you think you're still alive? Wait. Where's Vaughn? I... I don't know. Vaughn? Vaughn! When you have to get rid of a vault hunter, just bring in two vault hunters. You boys got everything? Yes, ma'am. <sighs> Lilith will be real happy to see this wretched piece of assassin trash hauled in. You needed Athena as much as I needed her out of my hair. I'm glad we were able to help each other out. Do you feel that, Athena? Now, it's over. That is one scary lady. Quiet, amigo. You want her to hear you? So, where's the last piece, little one? We have a vault to summon. Leave her alone. Tell me where it is before more of your friends get hurt. Starting with this hunk of scrap right here. Okay. Okay. It... It's there. On Helios.
The Hyperion Corporation welcomes you to Helios, your new home above the clouds. On Helios, you'll find a world of new opportunities. You'll see the galaxy as the pilot of your very own cruiser. Or even become a valued member of our custodial concierge team. All of this is made possible by hiring the best people in the business. And that makes you the best. So, are you ready to begin your new life here with Hyperion? Of course you are. Because at Hyperion, we make your life. Period. Reese?